good afternoon guys it's Jenny here from just Jenny journaling welcome back to my channel uh, today is a quick share of just uh, working on my autumn day book um, last time I think we popped the uh, November signature cover together and off camera since then I've basically popped together um, found some nice bits and pieces for September and uh, the October signature that um, I'm just gonna sort of pop together so we'll see those a bit later um, but today what I thought I'd do I'll turn the camera on because I just wanted to finish off the inside cover with the pockets so I've decided to um, I've decided to use these uh, this little bit that I found from last year this is the graphic 45 seasons that's the autumn and um, I want to use this as a pocket for the front back onto some Tim Holtz and this lovely postcard that um, Camille sent me from Australia and uh, she's uh, write, writing my renaissance on Instagram and so I'm going to pop that in the back so since I've been off camera all I've done is popped a little bit of lace a little lace panel just on the bottom here just because I had the let the um, silk was a little short and had some of the muslin showing which isn't too bad to be fair but I just wanted to cover it so what I'm going to do first um, I've actually used the acrylic gold um, acrylic paint to edge these and um, I might just what I thought I'd do is I wanted to place this here so I'm just going to edge it with the gold and let that set while we yeah so I'll probably just do that like that I think that's how I kind of envisage it so I used this little sponge last time I left it and it's actually really quite um it's set quite hard so anyway let's just go for that so what I'll do let's edge that first and then I'm going to glue it on to the blue backing it's going to be quite heavy but I think it's going to look pretty particularly with the gold tones in on the silk the gold and the blue so then how your day's been it's been a glorious day here really in fact I'm doing this in the garden I managed to sit out in the garden for most well this morning I had coffee and to be honest it had been so Cool. during the week I had almost put all my sort of throws and outdoor cushions in the loft I was just about to do that and then it started to cheer up yesterday so who knows eh who knows how it's gonna turn out so the next thing I'm going to do after this particular video is uh, we'll share pop in the November signatures together and it's going to be basic just lots of scraps um, a real eclectic mix of different papers like I did last year and then as you go along I sort of um, sort of dress them accordingly some I don't do much with at all and some I worked on on a particular theme depending what my mood was so that really worked last but uh, really nice last winter. I liked the way my day book ended up. Oh, it's quite a lot going on there, guys. So let's leave that to dry for a few minutes. Let's pop that those on the side. Uh, so what I'm going to do with this one, I just thought I would kind of layer it. That's going to go on like that. And I think that's a bit heavy handed. I like the way, if you can see it, kind of off. I like the way, I don't know if you noticed in the picture, you've got the gilt kind of frames on the, the, uh, the on the postcard on the picture. The picture's there, and I thought this kind of picks it up. I like that, and I want that just to go down there ah 
what I was going to do was let's glue that in position. I'm at that awful stage again, guys, where the am I doing that like that? Yeah, I am. Let's glue that down. The uh, fabric tacks at the end of the end of the bottle again didn't last long, did it? Did I have one video where I had the fabric tack was decent? And now I'm back to the old ways. But you know, it kind of comes out in the wash, doesn't it? All works out in the end. Let's pop that up there like so. That's yep. It's not in any one any anyone's way. And then let's do the get the hole punch. Circle punch is called, isn't it? Not hole punch. I always get mixed up with these technical terms, guys. And if you do, and let's see. What do? Oh, <laughs> This will be just a little. Actually, let's pop it. No, we will pop it there. I should have put that a bit centered up there, shouldn't I? Never mind. Or shall I? Yeah, that might look a bit better. And I can edge something under here at a later date. Yeah, I think that will be a little bit easier on the eye, won't it? And we'll pop it on the bottom. Let's do that. So, this is just a whole little bit, so it's not major, because I do have a, um, from a happy mail that I've received, a little coin envelope that I can pop in, perhaps on the back of one of the signatures, for other bits and pieces. Oh, I wonder if that will be a bit much under there. Nope, let's, so. Let's pop this here, like so. Let's pop that there, like so. I think that will do nicely. And we've got little bits we can pop in. I wonder if it might be too big, but you know. But that's on that side, that's the back. And we'll see, we could washy, couldn't we? We could washy or lace. Lace, another piece of this perhaps down the bottom. Don't know. Yeah, we'll see guys. We'll see how that see that how that works out for us. So that's the back. We might even dress that a little bit more in the next video so that's the back pocket and then at the front I wanted this yes I wanted to let's see these are set so let's pop that on there like so it's really quite rough and ready quite rustic and it's not um well isn't it it's a pity to actually I did think about using this as a tag, kind of movable, but I wouldn't move it around to be fair. Um, I, I wouldn't use it like that. Um, so in the end I thought, let's just make it into a front pocket and it'll be a real nice feature. As soon as you open the, as soon as I open the journal, it will cheer me up. And it does go so nicely with, with that, beautifully goes beautifully and I think the blue the hint of blue let's just put it on kind of straight like that and then what I'll do is I will do the little circle punch 
So we're going to pop this up here like that. We'll pop that across like so. Do I want it that way around? Do I want it that way around? So we'll pop that. I think, yes, that was it. Because in my head, I really wanted this still to show this blue part of the design. I thought that would look nice. So let's get that, pop it around here. Circle punch like so. Like so. And double. Let's do a little. Can't really do it. There you go. So I wanted to place it up there, didn't I? Let me just check that again. And then that will go across here like so. I might just do that as a little tuck as well. So if I wanted to. But in reality, would I want to cover this up? Probably not. Probably not, to be honest. Right, I'll tell you what, I'm just going to stick it right down. So let's get the pocket. Let's get the pocket down. So I'm just doing it around the three corners. It's amazing, isn't it, for me, just how quickly I go through my fabric tack. I think I've got two or three bottles on the go. I thought I'd a newer one, and I probably do. The dining table is strewn at the moment because I've got quite a few projects on the go, to be fair. So it's probably just tucked away. Yeah, let's pop that like that. It's probably tucked away under something. I'm going to spend a few minutes in the morning just tidying around so I can see what I'm doing. And then I will I will place that just here like so. Because you'll see once that signature's in like that, see how it kind of balances up with a blue 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 peeking out and the yellows so yeah that's why I kind of I've got kind of got going on in my head oh a bit of a cold the last few days like the first it came on really quickly Thursday really quickly and uh sore throat headache and yeah, you're not very pleasant and uh, it's not so bad today not so bad today let's see but it's just still a bit sniffly now and again now we pop that down like that just make sure it's oh yes that's fine that's fine let's So, that's my pockets done, front and back, I'm hoping, I have some little bits and pieces I could slip in here, <laughs> should I wish, here, and here. I didn't want to do too many layers because I didn't want um, it to be too bulky, but I will have some spaces on the inside. For uh, slipping things in, put some pieces that pertain to the month. So there you have it, guys. Front and back. Really quite pleased with that. Looks a bit rough for now, um, but once I've tied, once this is in, I think you'll be able to see how beautiful that will look. Um, it's the second one. And then this one will be, that'll be, yeah. Okay, so that's it guys, that's me, uh, so that's the, the pockets, inside pockets are in. Join me next, what we'll be doing is just um, completing, um, we'll
we'll pop the November signature together. Choose use the pages, pop them in. And then after that, what I'll do is I'll just do a little video of um, tying the signatures into the journal. So thank you very much for uh, joining me, taking the time out today. I hope you've enjoyed this and found it a little bit useful. I hope it will give you some inspiration maybe to close some pages together yourself for a, a, um, an autumn journal. And uh, that you'd enjoy doing that and actually working in it too. So thanks again. And um, so if you like what you see, if you um, please uh, like, press the like button and subscribe if you haven't before to my channel. Um, and just press the little bell this little bell icon up there which uh, means that you'll be um, automatically alerted every time I um, every time we upload something new which uh, may sound quite obvious but I didn't know that until someone said it on a video just a few weeks ago <laughs> I had no idea so anyway that's it take care guys Hope you have a good day bye 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 bye